Okay, we're back on Grim Nasty TV. One thing I keep noticing is that uh, a lot of these rock stars, they're talking about, uh, like, how things started with, like, uh, you know, like, adult things, like uh, adult films or adult, like, call situations. You know what I mean? Like, call girl situations. Well, anyways, from what I've discovered is a brilliant uh, thing that, no one's told me, but it seems to be piecing itself together. Is that, and then obviously the paint, the the picture gets painted as something else. But I was watching Taxi Driver, and uh, a Hollywood character is on there, and uh, there's a guy that's got these checkerboard clothes, and he's like, "Yeah, that's my girl or whatever," uh, you know, give her the cash and all this, and it just kind of stuck in my mind, and I was just like, "So what happens?" I think is that uh since the Federal Reserve notes have uh, birth certificate numbers on them, that uh, since these people don't need cash, that at one point or another time, or maybe at some time, maybe that uh, that they would take cash from elites or somebody so they can make claims on humans. So it's uh, it sounds extremely brilliant. I was just like thinking about that, like, and I just want to mention things that because uh, there's a lot of uh, rumors about things in general. So whenever these things come out, it's good to see uh, a bright side to it. You know, if people have things to say about stuff like that. But uh, anywho, uh, these songs that I'm seeing here are saying something about uh, making me shiver, you give me fever, stuff like that. Ed Sheraton is, uh, it looks like it says Ed Sheeran, but people say Ed Sheraton. So when I think about the Tin Man, and how these names are kind of fake when they break down the names it says share a 10 kind of like you know like uh miguel uh and the and the fucking suitcase on the door when it had the water coming out of it and he was running down the hallway so uh yeah i was you know i was just kind of piecing that together like oh okay share a 10 so he's like so he's one of the workers or something <laughs> rick moranis all right so here we go so when I, these shiver things, all right, so he's got this song, it says, uh, she gives me the shivers, and then uh, you want to dance to the sunlight cracks, and then something gives me the shivers. So right now, at this moment, whenever I'm getting hot, and this is why I want to talk about this whole video, is because right now, at this moment, I am receiving body shivers while I'm uh, bringing up the heat, and the shivers are bringing forth a, a mass amount of goosebumps that are turning undoubtedly now into dna activation as i looked at my legs there were giant bumps all around like the ones on my hands and i was shocked to see that so these shivers and the dmt coming out of the head is is all leading to the idea that the body when it bursts into flame that the body has its own anesthesia and the dmt just comes flowing out like at that point you feel like you're extremely super high and uh, you get shivers. The outside of your body is cold while the inside is extremely hot. So that was pretty much what I pushed myself to yesterday. And uh, and I was just now, just now, trying to bring the heat back out. I guess I'm used to it. So now I'm gonna try to up the ante more. So the sun's supposed to get up to 80 degrees today. Hilarious enough, they're still playing with the weather. They're trying to make it snow again. So they're, it's funny. It's like they're gonna make it snow apparently and it's 80 degrees right now in the Midwest during uh, fake fictional February. But can you imagine? They're taking it to new extremes. So they're just not professional at all whatsoever. I'm just creating uh, a consensus of rapport, people that are witnessing this. We did file mandates against a harp and the high circle stamp was on it. We took it and we filed it with the government and a bunch of other things. And uh, it's setting the ground stage for what comes next, obviously, in this whole movie that we're calling the real true meaning of life. So, yeah, with that being said, there's a lot of stuff happening. Federal Reserve notes uh, in general and what they have on them as uh, claims that can be made on uh, human beings. But uh, I don't think that it's, you know, legit. It's just all just a fraud. It's just a fictional fraud scheme, you know. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, it's all it's all like uh, coming to a head. Yeah, pyramid scheme coming to a head. Interesting.
Stay tuned for more Grim Nasty TV as he goes past the shiver stage and into another stage. And perhaps the fire was not as bad as he thought, but we will see when it gets hot. Stay tuned and stay awake.